Right, so I've got some purees here. This is my carrot puree. Right there. So I'm just going to show you a couple of ways that I like to put them on a plate. So we just snip the end off. And we get that little one. Okay. First one I'm going to do is the old, the wavy one, like so. Okay. Let's come out a little bit. So you've got those little waves there. I haven't thought about this because I need another plate. Okay. Next wave. Next wave. Okay. Let's do some dots. So can we see this plate? Yeah, I've got the plate on. So dots, we do one, big one. It's kind of just decreasing in size all the way down. Like right, so. And again, just see some wiggles. There's the wiggles. And I can also do some straights, some straight ones. Let's go straight down, like so. Dublin. So you got the dots, wiggle, straight lines. And then I'm gonna do this one, but with a spinach puree as well. So this is a spinach puree that we got. Just go and slip the end off. Just give it a test. And then. Oh, that's coming out lovely. Something like that. And then with the, the orange, the orange, the uh, carrot, I just go like next to it somewhere like that. Slightly different, slightly different uh, plate in there. And then I'm also going to have a look at um, this one. So this is the cauliflower. So the cauliflower one, can we see that? Green, yellow, green, yellow. So you've got spinach and carrot puree. And I'll just do some of the cauliflower. Just on that, like so. And there we go. So it's really, you can put some ingredients on there and then play around with this a little bit. So yeah, that's a couple of, couple of different ways of, um, a couple of different ways of putting some purees on a plate. And that was a cauliflower, carrot, and the spinach. Ta-da! Thank you.